with me. I have all these cool toys to show you. Lots of cool science toys that I don't think you've ever seen before. If you have, comment below, let me know which one you have seen. Our first item is called a Zero Blaster. Three, two, one. Whoa. <laughs> boing, 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 boing. I'll help you. Wow. Three, two, one. Cool, right? Let's shoot the cameras so they can see. Look at the camera lens, that's so cool. You could actually see the fog rings coming out at you. Ah. These are bigger. Hit the lens. Go get, go, go, look at the lens. That's cool, right? You see that? Let's try to get the lens, right? The middle of the lens. No, that's too high, that's too far to the right. Lower, higher. Are you guys seeing these rings? Are they coming out on camera? I hope they are, because they're really cool. All right, our next item is called either the Row Lollipop or the more expensive version from Playable Art is called the Helicone. I think we'll do this one. Yeah, we're gonna do that one. Now what's cool about this one, that's this right here. Look what, look what you do with it. It takes a little bit of skill. It's made of really good wood. It's really nice. This is like great for an office or something. And it's so satisfying. It works so smoothly. The cool thing about it is you, it's like, this one's like a puzzle. Maybe the other one is like a puzzle too, but I definitely don't want to take that one apart. You could actually take the pieces off and align it however you want. So you could just do it like that. I do it. Isn't that cool? You have all the pieces here and you could just one by one. And your final result is a row lollipop. See if you can spin it. Like this. Here, ready? Here, I'll do it with you. Hold, hold your hand open. See if we can do this. Whoa! Sort of. Maybe. I don't know. But you know what else is good for? Tickly! <laughs> All right, moving on to our next item. This next item is CJ's favorite. I put these in two days ago into a bucket of water. And now, dun dun dun! Whoa! Look at this green one. Isn't that wild? To show them. Whoa! It just breaks apart really easily. Blue and, and red and even clear. And who's, here's two clear ones. Clear, no color. I'm dropping it in here and watch. Where'd it go? It just disappeared. How cool is that? You see it? Look, let's move this back a little. It looks like there's nothing in here besides my hand. Would you believe if I said there are three balls in here? Three. Looks like I'm holding nothing, right? Mm. One. Cool. Careful with it. Let me drop it in here. I'll drop the next one. Okay, drop the next one. Looks like I'm holding just nothing. Two. It's just so cool. Look at it. You, you see through it. Look, you see CJ behind me. How cool is that? Don't miss. Nice job. And three, oh, there are four, actually. Look at this. It looks like I'm holding nothing. How crazy. Thank you. Another two. Another two. These are wild. Can I do two? Yes, you can. Whoa. It almost fall, fell out of my hand. All right, guys. Next product we have up is called the Feel Flux. This defies gravity. Watch. This is a regular ball. This has a hole through it. CJ's going to drop the ball through the hole. Watch what happens. Whoa, whoa, get it. Good job, look. Put your hand by the couch. Nice, right? Isn't that cool? Yes. Nice, so that's a feel flux, and it comes in another version as well. This juggling set is what it is, look, watch. Isn't that cool? All right, are you ready for the next cool thing? Yeah! This is a hand boiler. Wrap your hand around it. A little, little hand. Oh, there it goes. It's going up. You're doing it. That's cool. His hand is boiling. The heat from his hand 
is boiling the water and making it go all the way to the top. Your hand boils the liquid and you see as I'm showing you here, the liquid starts heading up, up from the heat in your hands. I have to cover it a little more so that it gets hotter. You see it heading up? Isn't that cool? It's heading up to the top chamber where it's boiling a little bit. And if you want it to go the other way, just wrap your hand around it and watch. See that? All the liquid is now heading to the bottom part and there is nothing left in the top. This is hard. This is not like a soft squishy, yeah. All right, for our next item, this is called a wonder wire. And of course it tickles, of course it tickles, but it actually does something really cool. It's from the same company that made the Helicone that I showed you earlier from Playable Art. Now this wonder wire is an illusion, a really cool science illusion. Let me show them first and then you'll do it. So it's two wires connected, right? In the middle, you see how the wires are sort of connected to each other. So when you try to separate it, watch what happens. It's getting longer and longer and longer, right? But nothing happens. It does not separate no matter how much you try. This is just hypnotic to watch. I'll bring it up closer so you can see what's happening. This I think is my favorite one. CJ, you wanna try it? He's always trying to like rip it apart. Soft, very, very soft. Two fingers. Watch. Look at the middle. Is it coming off? It looks like it should come off, right? Cool. Good. Okay. It can't come apart. It never, it never separates. That's what's cool about it. We should do this like on a black background so you guys can really see it. This is just, this is cool. Like if you agree. Now I know I've been saying this a lot, but this one is super epic. It looks like a 3D puzzle. In a way it is. It looks like you could stick your hand through it, but watch what this really is. is 20 years old, not 30, I thought, it was tw I thought it was 30. Guys, this is a 20 year old science toy that I just opened, I bought it on eBay, I thought it was 30, it's actually 20, it says 1999, made in the USA, 1999 copyright. 20 years old, sitting in a box, just waiting for YouTube and you guys to finally release the genie from the box. Moving on. This is the macro bank, guys. So you take all your change and you just put it in here, you drop it in here. And I don't know if you could see, but it's shrinking it. It looks like it's shrinking it because how else would all this change, seemingly never ending, just fit in this bank? So the money seems to be shrinking and fitting in that tiny little compartment. Let me zoom you in so you could get a better view. And it just shrinks. So that is pretty cool. An even closer up view. All that money shrunk in that little box. All right, next we have our gyroscope. I did a video on this years ago. Let me show you what I think is the coolest trick from it. So you sort of got to thread the needle here, then twirl it. They have ones where you just put a stick in, but this is like the authentic, the vintage, the original type of gyroscope. So I'm spinning it as you see here. I'm spinning the string around and I'm just gonna give it a nice pull on it to get it rotating. Now what's cool, this could balance on anything, but a special trick with this one is you put it in this box right here. Close the box and then get it spinning. You have to find the edge, there it is on its edge and the box is spinning with the gyroscope. That is sick, I love this trick. Love the gyroscope and you, you'll take it out and you'll see it's still spinning. And you could still do all sorts of tongue cool tricks with it. That is really cool, the gyroscope. 
Like this one's from Tedco. If you like satisfying toys, Crazy Aaron's hyper color changing putty is the best that it gets because, I mean, it depends what color you like. This one, this one happens to be like a pink orange one. And I'll show you something cool about it. So, this one happens to be pretty soft. Some of them are harder. I like soft putty. It's just easier if you want something to work out your stress. You know, you don't want to have to work too hard on it and then you'll be all stressed all over again. So I'm just putting half in here and I'm going to work this half for about a minute and then I'll show you something cool. Comment below. Let me know what you think is going to happen. Alright, here we go. So I've been working on this for about a minute, not more. And you're probably wondering, okay, what happened? Now, if we open the tin where I left the other half, Look at that, look at the difference in the color of the putties. I don't know if the lighting is showing it, it is. This just became a total pink, that's like an orange. Fun putty to play with. If you play with it, just the whole piece, you you know, it's hard to see a change. What a lot of kids like to do these days is make a bubble out of the putty. So you make just like a little pocket of air and then just fold it, trapping some air in it. And then all you need to do is give it a good whack. Boom. Bounces too, which is cool, so you could just make a ball out of it. And it's just fun. So, tons of stuff you could do with it. This is one of my favorites, Crazy Irons. Flamingo Feathers, Thinking Putty, they have so many other ones. Light up ones, ones you could write on. Another cool science toy. This really is mind blowing, because this robot, you turn it on, and it just, it just goes, right? Okay, it's cool, what's so cool about a robot that just moves? If you take a marker, and you draw on a piece of paper, draw a path, it will follow the path. Let me get untangled from my mic. Let me show you with the camera. We'll put the robot on the path. Watch it follow the path. How crazy is that? Now I should have continued the path. Oh, it found the path again. Oh, it's going in circles now. Okay, go oh, this way. This way, dude. There we go. You can make any path you want. It could follow it. Okay, and last but not least, I have something called Babble Buds. Yeah, so you sort of figure out what it does. And you could actually change his voice to one of three different voices. That's actually pretty creepy. Yeah, this one is a robot voice. Listen. Now, what's interesting about this one is I made a commercial for this company. From I made a commercial for this company. I'm trying to do a video here. <laughs> for Mindscope, who makes this product, it's going to be on QVC. They're running a bit ad, big ad campaign online. So, yeah. To make a long story short, I made a 60-second commercial spot for this bear, for the the product that they sell. If you want to see that 60 second commercial, not just the 60 second commercial, but I spent weeks making it with CJ and my daughter. There was a lot involved and it's amazing how much work is involved for just one 60 second commercial spot. So if you want to see that whole process, some behind the scenes bloopers, some of the hardships I went through filming it and then finally coming out with that 60 second clip, comment commercial below and if we get enough I'll do it. I'll post it. I'll put it together. All right. Shout outs from the last two videos are Ethan Wise, Kimberly Sanchez, Rifka Merov, Anthony Farah, Shining Tess and Amin, and Axe Gaiman. Thank you so much for commenting. If you want a shout out in the next video, just type in hashtag shout out. And the winner of the t-shirt and the $100 bill is Para42. Congratulations. I'll be contacting you. If you want to win something in the next video, a t-shirt and a $100 bill, stay tuned to the next video and I will tell you how to win. I just chose a random comment from last video so make sure to comment something and I will choose one at random in the next video and then maybe we'll have another contest for a bonus prize in the next video as well maybe I'll give away some of these science toys that I saw today let me know what your favorite toy from today was for me I'm not sure there were a lot I definitely like the wire one a lot but I guess you know you it, the putty was really good. This, I guess for different things, you know, you like different, but I'm curious to know, so comment below. Let me know what you like the best. I have to get ready for the next video. It is going to be really, really cool. If you like this sort of video, by the way, let me know below as well. Comment below. Uh, 
top toy, top 10 science toys if you want to see me do more of these videos. And as always, stay incredible. I will see you soon. Peace out.